Any comic will tell you, there is nothing like being on stage. <laughs> the crowd, the energy, and of course, the laughs. <laughs> it's safe to say Elk Grove native DJ Sandu was living his dreams, but that quickly changed. February, everything was looking beautiful. I had just moved to Las Vegas, and then on like March 20th, everything canceled on me. So I had about $15,000 worth of gigs cancel on me. Gigs he spent years working to achieve. We shut down with everybody else, and then we opened back up for three weeks, got shut down again. Small businesses are really trying hard to, I mean, stay in business, really. Without places like this, people like me don't have anywhere to go to grow so that we can become people like Dave Chappelle. So Jennifer had an idea. And we were talking to a friend about we had gone to a silent disco and the two ideas kind of became one. And we go, what if we did silent comedy? So Canfield decided to pull out her stage out into the cobblestone streets of old Sacramento. We went to the city to try to get permission to use the parking spots in front of us. And they went a little farther and gave us permission to close off the entire street. The stage, the lights, the laughs. <laughs> Oh, and the glowing green headphones will let you know the show's about to begin. The headphones, chairs, tables, everything is cleaned and sanitized before and after. Additionally, the outdoor shows have limited capacity, and guests are encouraged to wear masks when not sitting at their tables. Kind of block party style, except you're at a table and chair with social distancing and headphones. And the comedians appear to be enjoying it too. It just hits better. It's a new way this small business owner is adapting to an unknown future. And just in time to celebrate the club's 40th anniversary this week. For the next three weeks, we're going to have 40 comics to celebrate 40 years in Sacramento as the original comedy club in Sacramento. Everybody's on the menu. If you have emotions, I would suggest staying at home. You're not laughing, you're taking notes. You're welcome. <laughs> Just come out and laugh. I can't, uh, I can't say that it's the cure for COVID, but, you know, it's got to be something close, right? <laughs>